Hey everyone, so this technique is a technique called the Taylor Rock. It's a joint mobilization technique for the Taylor crawl joint. So basically what we're trying to do here is improve mobility, decrease pain and stiffness in the Taylor crawl joint. So the joint between the talus, the fibula and the, and the tibia. So we're trying to pull this talus down, distract it down, open up the joint and then move the foot through dorsiflexion and plantar flexion to create that general decompression, help with pain, help with uh, mobility. So what we're gonna do here is take the, the person, put them in sideline position with my back sitting on the table, with my back up against their thigh as a, as a supporting point. So I'm gonna to try to traction the foot away from the leg using my back to hold their thigh in place so that I can anchor the leg down. So here, the top hand comes around, grips over the front of uh, the front of the ankle, so basically in front of the tailor, the tailor's bone. The other hand comes around the back of the calcaneus. Uh, the thumbs pointing, touching one another underneath the lateral malleoli and the index fingers on the other side doing the same thing below the medial malleoli. And then from here, I'm gonna create a traction force so pulling the foot away from the leg and then moving the foot through plantar and dorsiflexion. You won't get a lot of range uh, as it's difficult for the joints to glide over or the, the bones to glide over one another through that joint. But what you'll often feel is as you move through those end ranges, there'll be a bit of a clunk or a click, which is fine. Um, it shouldn't be, shouldn't be uncomfortable or painful. Uh, but that general distraction with movement concept is great for decompressing that joint. Anyone that has stiff, painful, tight ankles, uh, very non-specific in origin, this is a fantastic technique. Um, so the person who's lacking dorsiflexion, most likely going to the gym, having trouble getting into a low squat, difficulty uh, with forward, with uh, full fluid motion into extension while running, trying to improve that, usually dorsiflexion is the deficit. Uh, this is a great technique to just open up that joint, decompress, reduce pain, improve range of motion. You'd probably spend somewhere between 20 to 30 seconds in that movement, making sure you're not producing pain, keeping it a low level of irritation, shouldn't be uncomfortable, uh, and then reassess range of motion afterwards.